Hi everybody, so uh, about a month ago I went down to Glasgow for two concerts and as usual during Christmas time they have a market and one of the stalls there was just Russian dolls and in the past I bought a Russian doll a Snow, Disney Snow White themed Russian doll for my niece so I decided to get her another one this time uh, just a Russian doll ordinary Russian doll one I also got a Beatles one for my brother who's music mad and a Batman one for myself so I'm going to go through them Start with just the regular this Russian doll one. Uh, got a glossy one. They said glossy ones are better for kids because they won't get damage. They had some very nice ones with glitter on and stuff, but those would get damaged quite easily because uh, kids will just play around with them. So I'll just have a quick look at it. Very nice, they showed me how they make, I asked how they make them, they showed me, it's very intricate process. I wish that you, this was smell of vision or something, because the insides of these smell absolutely divine, the wooden, the wood is just absolutely beautiful smell. So I'll open this one up get the next one up and he says if it makes a certain pop then you know it's a really good it's just you look inside there and in there really oh, oh it's gorgeous so the next one I like a little smile there. I like this one because of like the gold on top and on here as well. That's why I chose this one really. sound it's a bit. and here we have the next one and it falls straight out of my hand no gold on top this time <sighs> this time the face is getting a bit weird <laughs> Still a lovely paint job though, around the body. And now you know things are weird. That just looks a bit off. So all lined up. That's what the Russian dolls classic ones look like. Put them aside. Now have a look at the Beatles. Okay, that is clearly John Lennon. I don't know though if that is painted or if that's a transfer. I forgot to ask because it 
definitely is a great light in this. And that side there, it's got Jay Lennon and it's got his guitar. But I don't know if you could get that lightness just by painting quickly. I asked if they had frozen ones and he said I must be about the hundredth person to ask that. It's such a big opportunity missed. He said he would have made about a thousand pounds if he had frozen ones. He only saw the film recently. Is Paul McCartney no lettering though? Definitely him though. And my favourite, George Harrison, again, beautiful likeness. And the ugly one, Ringo Starr, again, it's, even though it's um, a tiny one, likeness is still there, that's why it makes me wonder if it's not a transfer or something. Unless you've got a really good artist. And at the bottom, you just got um, a small note, musical note. So again, just line them all up. Uh, Ringo's stubborn. Doesn't want to stay. It's a bit wonky. So there are all of the Beatles, Russian dolls. I think they're pretty cool. Tempted to keep them for myself, but no. The Both of these ones were £14 each. That one, because it's a character, he said it was £18 each, but I managed to knock it down to £14 each because I was buying free. I'm sure that if I haggled him a bit more, I could have got it to, um, so it was, um, that would have made it 42. I'm sure I could have got it for 40 pounds each, but he's a nice guy. Uh, I didn't really want to. All right, I'll just be back in a sec to display the Batman ones. Okay, so now I'll go on to the Batman ones. Uh, when I first got them, when I first picked it up to look at, I didn't realise it was Batman, the animated series. Just thought it was Batman. Pretty plain, nothing on the back. Still nice though. Nice Batman logo. No circle around it. I prefer just a bat. Open it up. And you get Robin. like the spiky hair still okay and this is where I got a bit confused because first time that I looked at it I didn't buy them straight away I just had a look I thought this was cat girl I mean cat woman sorry because the hair sort of blends in with the background colour and the ears are sort of exact shape as Catwoman's so I thought this was um, Catwoman not Batgirl I did think it was the animated series but I wasn't too sure uh, and I thought this was just another Robin I didn't realize the um, ponytail straight away it's a bit lost at first but yeah, Nightwing for the second to last, the penultimate. And then you get just a small bat with 
splodges for eyes. Which I think is pretty cool, good. But the second time around when I decided I was going to get it and just wanted to have another look, I did realise that it was, of course, the animated series. So, if I can get that aligned. Let's see, it doesn't want to stay in position that I want it to. I think they're pretty good. It's nice to have a Russian doll set. sound squeaky bum time so there are all my batman ones aligned batman animated knock them all down okay so one final shot and here are all my russian dolls uh not my, mine but all the russian dolls that i bought out of their main mothers I suppose you could say and uh, lined up you got all of the Beatles all the Batman ones and all the classic ones so that's 15 in total these are the only ones that I will be keeping. That one has a problem standing up. As you can see, it just doesn't want to. It's not smooth at the bottom. None of the Batman ones are really finished properly at the bottom. I think you can see there. needs to be sanded down or something but anyway just a quick video showing these off before they're sent off hopefully they'll get to the people in time i hope you liked it and peace to all take care bye